<laughs> Here's how this works, because it's a lot of misconceptions about safety. You send your kids off to the park and give them the phone and just get in trouble, just give me a call. So here's the deal. I'm, you're going to recognize that I'm a threat. And you can't run, you can't hit me or anything. And I'm not going to touch you either. <laughs> your job is to get your phone out and call 911. Okay. When I get close to you, I'm going to become that 911 operator. So I'm going to ask you where you're at, what's going on, what's your situation, describe the assailant, 6'5", bald, kind of like the rock. And, <laughs> and we'll see how that goes, shall we? Oh, now, how much room do you need in order to get that done before I get to you? Now, I won't run to you. I'm just going to walk. Uh, a lot of room. A lot of room. <laughs> <laughs> how about if you stand right here, okay. up, right here, actually. Okay. Yeah, this is a good spot right here. here. Okay, yes. All right, okay. so I'm over here, and it's a Walmart parking lot at 3.30, and I see that you've got your purse and all that kind of stuff, and here I'm coming after you. I'm just going to walk at you. Scenario is live. Hey, lady, give me that phone. Give me your purse. Don't, you can't back up. You can't back up. Coat, you can't back up. 911, what's your emergency? Um, he has a Walmart at the parking lot. Some guy's following me. Uh, he's 6'5 or something. <laughs> <laughs> what's your address? What's your location? I don't know the address. I'm going to Walmart and this <laughs> Great. Thank you very much. Round of applause. <laughs> Did this save her? No. Not even close. The best thing she could do with it is hit me with it. They don't even ask you your emergency first, FYI. They ask you like 47 questions. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. All the more. <laughs>